Hey everyone, so this is a project I started many months ago and I haven't had a free evening for a very long time but over Christmas I thought well let's carry on doing this little project. Now this is my own sort of concoction I've come up with. Basically it's an electric Edison recorder and it allows you to plug this directly into an amplifier and cut directly electronically to wax cylinder. And I'm going to come up with a Mark III version. I call this the Mark II uh, version, as I did one many years ago. And this one is a dramatic improvement of the last one. And uh, the other one, hopefully with the knowledge I've gained from making this one, the Mark III version should be better. So if we come along here, we've got our guitar amplifier. And we have uh, this... Edison Home Model B from 1905. We can tell it's the Model B as there's no speed control where, where um, on the Model A there would be one. So we're going to see how our test cut came out. Now I slowed the machine up. I was worried I wouldn't fit the song on. Um, I slowed it up to about 145 RPM um, just to be on the safe side. So I hope I don't get a copyright strike from Facebook because they do that nowadays, don't they? So let's have a listen how it came out, if we got a result at all. So here we go. And there we go. I wonder what Thomas Edison would think of that. A bit of rock and roll there from on a 1905 phonograph. I think people would have had a shock if they heard that coming out of the machine 100 years ago. But uh, wow, actually, uh, that amazed me. Um, I could hear some, we call it recorder chatter, especially on the lower frequencies. But that's going to be all solved on the Mark III version. So I hope that came out on the camera. Pleased with that. There we go. Good bit of experimentation there tonight. So hope you enjoyed it and hope you look forward to some more videos coming up.